Okay, we're going to try this again. This is May 8, 16th, 5 o'clock at night. It rained. You can see it's pretty gray out. Um, we've had about 6 inches or so of rain the last couple days, so it's really wet. We'll do a quick walkthrough for you. I added pine shavings this week into my beds. And as you can see how big the lettuce has gotten from last week. It's just at least double. It's crazy. Mm. Put some flowers in my flower pots. Um, let's see. Columbine have flowered very nicely. That one's my favorite. The pink. My purple beans are coming in. They're sporadic. Some didn't, some didn't come up, but that's okay. I should have plenty anyway. Asparagus. My strawberries. Okay, and then up there, rows and rows. And they're actually doing really well. The third one I think is going to die. <laughs> my clematis still has not opened. But when it does, it's going to be covered because there's a ton of blooms on it. Um, and the little one that I got, it has gotten good size. And then I just got two more yesterday. This blue purple, it's actually more of like a purple color. And then this one is a a burgundy color. It's beautiful. But anyway, so there'll be all four of them and they'll cover the whole trellis. It'll be beautiful. Again, my carrots and the lettuce. My strawberries on this side are doing really well. The peony bush has probably doubled in size. I don't see any buds on it. It probably won't do anything this year. My onions. There's my peony bush there. It's got one big bloom. I'm hoping it's going to open soon, but we'll see. This is that salvia, and it's got those blue-purple flowers. Let's see if I can get it to focus. There we go. Anyway, it's very pretty. I like it. Silver mound in there. Those are the chocolate-flavored flowers. We'll see. As you can see how much it rained. Look at all the mud. It has squished, washed underneath my chairs. Um, it's crazy. That's a rose bush I bought yesterday as well, but I haven't figured out where I'm going to put it yet. But it's a really deep, deep red. The chives are blooming. And this, I don't know, remember the name of it, but it's really pretty. And then I have a Chinese lantern. It's got a new bloom. Check this out. Pretty cool, huh? Anyway, I just put in a couple pepper plants. Mine did not um, germinate, so I'll have to buy new seeds next year. But anyway, and then my butternut squash are coming in really nicely. My banana pell pepper and my artichoke, which is, is a perennial, but it's an annual here because it doesn't survive the winters. I got the beets coming up and the peas on the trellis. My lettuce here, which again is getting huge, in my peas. I have got pine shavings down. I did hay, and then I pulled it all out and did the pine shavings because I think it looks better and it was easier to get around the little plants. So there's some more beets, cucumber. Kohlrabi is getting big. I've never had it, so we'll see. But I did have one of the leaves that tastes like cabbage, so I think I'll probably like it. Um, my Oswald eggplants, my squash and zucchini, which are getting very large. That one on the end is really yellow. I don't know why, but, um, hopefully it comes out of it. My mulch pile that's starting, you can see a couple of the blooms, rose blooms, and yes, I'm in the middle of working. Proof that I do work. Okay, my my greenhouse. These are all my passion fruit getting ready to be planted. Those are all things I've propagated and things I'm trying to grow. I don't know. I've got one little bitty plant there. Um, but I, I don't know if anything else is going to come up. So, okay. Here's my, my Spanish moss. 
and then more passion fruit there. And as we go down here, I put flowers in my wash bucket, and I also put the pine bark, pine shavings, in the Brussels sprouts as well. And there's Bud and Charlie. Wave! Charlie! That's the grapes. I think they're getting ready to go metal detecting. They call it beep beeping. Anyway, here's the coral bells. My coleus and my bleeding heart. I never had one, so I'm super excited. So, this is my, here's my chives. Aren't they pretty? I had a big old bumblebee. Look at that. This shows how much rain we had. It's just a muddy, swampy mess. Anyway. Well, not a whole lot different. Oh, I did get one more new statue. Check him out. Isn't he cute? Anyway, on that note, I'm going to go off of here and I... We'll see you next week.